Hello everyone. Today we are going to discuss magnets. We all have played with magnets. It's so much fun to see them attracting or pulling certain things. So today, let's find out the secret behind the magic of magnets. Magnets can have different shapes and sizes. The most common ones are the bar magnet and the horseshoe magnet. The ends of a magnet are called poles. One end is called the south pole while the other end is called the north pole. Even if we cut a magnet into half, we will get two similar magnets, each having its north and south pole. When the north pole of a magnet faces the south pole of another magnet, they attract each other. It means unlike poles attract each other. When the north pole of a magnet faces the north pole of another magnet, they push each other away. It means the like poles repel each other. These acts of attraction and repulsion happen due to the magnetic force of a magnet. The area around a magnet in which this magnetic force is exerted is called the magnetic field. The magnetic field of a magnet is strongest near the magnet's poles. It means the force of a magnet is strongest at the poles. Therefore, it can be said that a magnet is a material that has its magnetic field. Even our earth is like a giant magnet with a liquid metal core deep inside it. The continuous rotation of earth generates a magnetic field around it. This magnetic field of the earth helps sailors to find north with the help of a compass. The materials which get attracted towards a magnet are called magnetic materials like the iron nails, steel paper clips and the needles made from steel. The materials which are not attracted towards a magnet are called non-magnetic materials. For example, plastic materials glass vessels and things made from aluminium. So now we know that a magnet's power of attraction is the result of science, not magic. We use magnets so often that we don't even realize that we are using them. You don't believe me? Okay. Let's see a few examples of the magnetic things we use in daily lives. The fridge magnet that hold important notes. The magnets in the microwave used to heat food. The magnets in computers to store the data. The magnets in televisions to produce pictures. The magnetic stripe on the credit cards to hold important codes. 
the magnetic locks found in the wallets and purses and many more items contain magnets hmm what are your favorite magnetic things please write us in the comments Thank you for watching the video. Please share it with everyone and do not forget to like and subscribe to our channel.